still waiting on that marriage proposal, ladies? Next stop. CSI New York, CBS Tonight. All right, hey, Maddie's parking the car, so you've got like two minutes to what that text was about. Well, they figured it out. What the hell are you talking? What are you doing? I'm packing, so when the big scary guy from playpoker.com comes back, he won't find me. Well, what scary guy? The man with the gun from the poker site where we've been cleaning up, all right? He was here like an hour ago looking for you and me. Why, what, are they cracking down? Because I've been hearing all these rumors about new regulations and stuff. Like, if, if you're in the States, you, they won't even let you play unless you've got a foreign account. Well, that's not the situation here. So what's the situation? The situation is they've caught us, okay? They, they know we've been cheating, right? And if we don't get out of here, they're gonna fill these shoes with cement and throw them and you and me into the river. So this guy had a gun? I, well, it's not like he showed it to me, okay? But he would have if he known who I was, okay? I told him, you know, Casey and Elwood flunked out and he went away. Oh, so what are you worried about then? Playpoker.com sends a, a, a big guy to Oakdale U to find two freshmen who got a little too lucky, and you don't think he's gonna come back? Testing. Hey. You're in a good mood. Christmas came early. Wow. Mm. Very pretty. Thank you. Casey got them for me. So, things must be good between you two. They are good. Better. Best. <laughs> and you? I'm actually really good. Good. I have good news for a change. I, I got in here next semester, so... That's great. Gwen must be over the moon. I haven't told her yet. She's in L.A. But I was looking for you and Casey. Well, we have to celebrate. This is the best news. I know. <laughs> Excuse me. Can either one of you tell me where I might find Casey Hughes? Gwen! Yeah. You did it! I know, You were amazing! <laughs> I want you to pick up a bottle of champagne. I want you to give it to my daughter, where I will be telling her all the nasty things that you said to her mama. like java coffee huh? it's the best i should order yeah i'll get out of your way say did you ever find her son who what from her science project the missing crystal the one that looked like the diamond simon gave you right right no you know she never did find that mm -hmm. I i'm sure it'll turn up no oh, somehow i doubt that something tells me that crystal's gone for good Take care. But Dolly, the coffee is much better at Lakeview. I'm not here for the coffee. I'm not Detective Snyder. Just the man I was looking for. Prince Adolfo. What brings you here? Don't you? You're trespassing. I the the door was open. Paul, even you should know better than to argue with someone I'm not who has arguing. a gun in their hand. I'm just what you, I'm you're trying. Just, you're just trying to get your own way again. Well, that time. That time has come and gone. As the World Turns is sponsored by Metamucil Capsules Plus Calcium. Stay regular. Stay strong. Trying to get more fiber and calcium in your diet? Well, it's so much easier with Metamucil Capsules Plus Calcium. It's fiber for regularity and calcium for your bones. Metamucil Capsules Plus Calcium. Stay regular. Stay strong. Ordinary toothbrushes can't stand up to it. Oral-B Triumph. Triumph's onboard computer and floss action brush head help give you cleaner teeth and healthier gums by your next checkup. Oral-B Triumph.
Because babies communicate through touch. New Pamper Sensitive Wipes with a Touch of Milk Essentials condition your baby's skin every time you use them. New Pamper Sensitive Wipes. Because every touch means so much. Ever notice how once your roots start showing, that's all you can think about? Try Root Touch-Up from Nice and Easy. In 10 minutes, it flawlessly matches your color, no matter which brand you use. Nice and Easy Root Touch-Up. The color-matching breakthrough from Clairol. Dressing can be rough with extremely dry skin. Instantly rescue it with new Olay Quench Therapy. It locks in moisture so relief of dry, itchy skin starts immediately. It's rescue therapy. Olay Quench Therapy. Is that you? Yeah. Last time we saw you, you were... A size small. Goodness. Find every size of men's sweaters and flannel shirts on sale. Kmart, where Christmas comes together. Hello? Oh. <clears throat> Do you have a change? Oh, yes, these look good, huh? Would you like, uh, uh cinnamon or blueberry? Hey, hey guys. <laughs> 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 When germs wear you down all day, take Airborne Nighttime. All the immune-boosting benefits plus natural herbs that can help you get a good night's rest and stay healthy. Have you taken your Airborne? Hello? You've got possibilities, let us give it a try. I see possibilities, maybe more than meets the eye. CBS News. See it now, anytime, anywhere. Queen Latifah hosts the award show where you pick the winners. Celebrate with me and the biggest names in movies, TV, and music. The People's Choice Awards, live CBS Tuesday, January 9th. May I? Meg! Is she here? Because I, I, I need to talk to her just for a minute. It's important. Meg! is no longer your concern. You should know that after the other day. Yeah, I know, at the wedding. She just needs a little time. That's no, 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 Paul, you've got it wrong. It's over. Meg no longer wants to marry you. Well, she can't marry me now with the way things are, but she didn't confide in you as to why she called the wedding off, did she? No, I didn't need to ask her. No. You've always been really good about giving her space mm -hmm. and, and, and time to, you know, figure things out. That's why I'm here. Okay, now I am only going to say this once. Meg does not want to marry you any longer. Well, for the you have hurt I'm sorry, what were you saying? my daughter yes. very badly. And? And I don't want you on this property any longer. Now, I am Emma. going to count to ten, and if you are not in the Emma. car and driving okay. away, Fine. one... You made your point, all right? Two... Could you tell her that I stopped by, Three. Please? I'm going. Mama! I'm glad you're Four. here. Could you please tell your mama to not shoot me? I gave him fair warning. Five! Mama, put the gun down, please. Thank you. I'll talk to you. Can we have a minute? Are you sure about this? What do you want? You know what I want? But maybe right now we could just talk a little? About what? So what's your hurry? Why do you want me out of here, huh? Greg outside? Is this what you were looking for? Shh. How quickly can you get me to the airport? The airport? I need a plane, like, now. Let's go. Congratulations. I knew you had it in you. Thank you. Um, and for the opportunity, but, but we should go. I need to pack. Uh, you know, our flight doesn't leave until later. You ever been to Griffith Park? No. You know, they do this amazing Christmas show. I mean, there's no snow, of course, but the lights are incredible. I was thinking maybe we could grab some dinner, check it out. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm not hungry. I don't really want anything. I just kind of want to go home. You want to talk about it? You think you could uh, call the airline, see if there's an earlier flight out tonight? Yeah, there's a flight in about an hour. You think you could be packed and ready to go? Yeah, if we leave for the hotel now. Okay, so let's go. We'll uh, call the airline from the car. 
I was told Casey Hughes lives on this floor. Uh, across the hall. Thank you. Sure. So, anyway, what does it feel like to matriculate? Uh, I felt pretty good until you had to go and scare me with that big <laughs> word. Maybe you should enroll. Next year. Fingers crossed. Yeah. So, are you and Gwen gonna live in the dorms, or...? Uh, it depends. You know, it'd be cool to live in the dorms with everybody, but Gwen and I like our privacy. Right. I don't know, it just, it feels good to be normal for a change. You know, it gets old having to tell everybody why. I'm not in school because I failed out, and I'm gonna be in school, but I got my GED and I'm not a bum, you know. Oh, nobody thinks you're a bum. Well, I feel like a loser watching everybody start school. You're gonna start? Yeah. Then come January, Gwen and I will both be students, and life will get back on track. Five will get you ten that the guy never comes back. Oh, you lose. It's not him. Double or nothing. Casey Hughes? I had my driver take me straight from the airport to your police station, where they told me that you were not at your desk, but on your way to a coffee bar. How can I help you, Your Highness? As you suggested, I had the crown jewels of Leonia removed from the vault and examined. And I'm horrified to report that your suspicions were correct. The collection contains a facsimile. But the necklace I wore at the gala is a fake? No, it's a fake. When I fastened it around your neck, it was a priceless treasure. Just so we're clear, you're accusing Miss Hyatt of stealing? He most certainly is not. I didn't steal your necklace, Dolly. I didn't even want to wear it, remember? But you insisted. And then you went running off to who knows where. You're the one who left the party and drove off with that horrible Carly person. I just left a powder my nose. The point is, the jewels are missing and must be returned. If you can't find my property, I'll be forced to report the theft to my embassy, and I can guarantee you heads will roll. How about we start with you filing an official complaint? You were in charge of security that night, Detective? I still am, Your Highness. Then I trust you'll take whatever steps necessary. I wouldn't worry, Dolly. I'm sure that the, the detective, he has all sorts of leads. Jack? Why do you look so glum? I'll do what I can, Your Highness. But if your jewels were stolen by a pro, which is what I suspect, they're long gone. Well, then you'll have to track down this pro. Or I'll be forced to take this story to the newspapers. And then you can kiss your reputation goodbye, detective. Can we go back to the hotel? I'm freezing, Dolly. We'll be at the Lakeview until further notice. I thought we were leaving for Santa Fe. Not until my property is being returned and the thieves are locked up. But all my good things are at the yacht. <clears throat> oh, I, um, I thought you'd gone. This little situation that you and Simon have created. What, what situation? Don't even try to play me, Carly. You know what I'm talking about. There's a problem. Things have changed. What things? Everything. French Vanilla Cool Whip. French Vanilla's here for that special time of year. To the Cool Whip. Happy holidays, just a dollop away. To the Cool Whip. Add the French Vanilla touch. That always means so much. Cocoa, apple pie, and cake. Ooh, it's time to celebrate. Ba la 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 la, French vanilla. Hmm, delayed. Oh, they're here. Very merry. Holidays. It smells delicious. Like pumpkin pie. I wonder why. Huh. One of those new Glade candles smells just like the real thing. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Introducing Glade's new line of holiday candles, now made with essential oils. You'll believe they're the real thing. They're new. And yes, they're Glade. S.C. Johnson, a family company. Imagine knowing you're pregnant the moment it happens. Science is getting close. They found a hormone variant that better predicts early pregnancy. First Response detects it. It tells you five days before your missed period. First Response, discovering ways to tell you first. Hey, my folks are here. McCormick has helped generations of holiday cooks get rave reviews. This is delicious. McCormick is the difference between a recipe and a family tradition. McCormick. The taste you trust. When play comes first, learning comes naturally. Well, hello there. Hello. My name is Theodore 
TJ's Berry Tales. With TJ Berry Tales, he's learning to love books. The world of TJ Berry Tales. Play comes first at play school. Jimmy! Live Daytona 500 every day. Daytona 500, a fragrance for men. Sorry, <clears throat> can barely speak. Sore throat, so painful. I need something stronger. Introducing new Sepacol Sore Throat Plus Coating Relief Lozenges. No drop can do all this. Only new Sepacol bathes your throat with two medicines. Maximum pain numbing relief plus a proven protectant for inflamed throat tissue. Yes, my throat is much better. Karaoke tonight? New Sepacol Plus Coating Relief Lozenges. Stronger medicine ends your sore throat emergency. Rev up the volume. Instantly. With Volume Express Mascara from Maybelline New York. Volume Express. Our instant volume formula and anti-clump brush zooms on three times more volume. You get three times fuller, three times more beautiful lashes. Instantly. With no clumps. Volume Express Mascara. From Maybelline, New York. Get traffic stop and lashes. Maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's Maybelline. Look, Mac, Casey Hughes flunked out. Honest. Not according to the dean. You got a B minus average. A little better in statistics, a little worse in American lit. Of course, if you laid off the cards, you might even make the dean's list. Look, I don't know who you think you are, but you've got five minutes to leave this room. I'm gonna call campus security. You going somewhere, Mr. Hoffman? I got a sick uncle. And I have a hunch you two boys enjoyed yourselves the last couple of weeks. And that's good, because at playpoker.com, we want our guests to have a good time. Because cards are fun. But we're always on the lookout for player collusion. Now, how do we do that? We check to see if any two players consistently wind up at the same poker table. And you two boys are regular table mates. <sighs> OK, so what? I mean, lots of guys at the dorm play poker. They do, and we're happy to have them on the site. But we've been monitoring you two boys. We've tracked the rate at which you raise your bets. Our IT divisions even clock the time it takes you to do that. Bottom line, we can prove you've broken the rules. You haven't been playing to win. You've been playing to beat the system. You've been comparing cards, collaborating on your bets. So even if you can prove this, so what? Well, oh, boys, you don't want to go there. My dad used to be the district attorney, you know which means he's well-versed in interstate commerce and no doubt eager to take a hold of a federal prosecution. Or we could just call him and see if uh, he wants to pay back that money you owe. Casey? Oh, that would be the pretty girl with the brown hair. Friend of yours? Hey, Casey, open the door. Hey. Hey. What's going on? Uh, this guy, um, uh, Elwood's in trouble. Elwood? Yeah, he's, he's tanking physics, so I'm trying to help him out. I got him a tutor. I thought it was some kind of physics genius. Well, I, I guess you never really know people. But anyways, I got to get back in. Oh, yeah, OK. I have to go. I have an exam tomorrow anyway. So call me, OK? OK. Congratulations. Thanks. Whoa, congratulations. I'm registering here next semester. You're going you're gonna to be here? I'm in. <laughs> uh, well, as soon as I can finish with this, we'll, uh, we'll celebrate, all right? All right, good. I'm there. Have you, uh, have you heard from LA? LA? Well, I don't when. Oh, the shoot, yeah, yeah. I thought you were all over that. No, I am, but this roommate thing, and I'm, I don't know. So what's the word? Nothing. I called them, and I haven't heard back. Oh, well, that's, that's probably because they shut their phones off when they're working. Yeah, I know. Well, no news is good news, right? Right. I know it. They just signed a deal with a major label. They, uh, they were a bar band, used to play in roller rings. I caught them one night in the valley. Nobody ever heard of them. Now they're guesting on Letterman. Huh. So it can happen. Yeah. And it's going to happen for you. Um, Gwen. Right. Adam's new girlfriend. No, I'm Adam's new singer. Yeah, well, sometimes it's not easy to catch the distinction. Uh, about that kiss. Yeah. Adam, I'm married. To my brother. I got that. I'm happily married. I hope so, for his sake. So, what was that? Kiss? Uh, just 
Just a guess. You were happy, I was happy. Gordon Richards just offered you a first look deal. You have any idea what that means? That's huge. I know. And, and I appreciate everything that you've done for me. But I just want to be really clear about you and me. You're the one with talent, not me. Look, we just got a little caught up. Of, you know, it was a, a kiss at a club. You stick around this business long enough, everybody's gonna want to kiss you. Is that is that rule number two after rule number one? That I have to put up with people that I don't trust or don't like. Now I have to kiss anybody who comes backstage. Hey, we just got some really good news. Yeah. Yeah, we did, and we crossed a line. No, no, no. I crossed a line. Look, we. The point is, is that it shouldn't have happened. Said we just got a little carried away. Because? Look, what do you want me to say? All right, you just come off stage. I just talked to Gordon. We were flying. Yeah, I wanted to kiss you. It wasn't something I thought about. It was something we just celebrated. All right, and for what? Like two seconds? Do you honestly think people are going to hold a few seconds of celebrating against us? That's quite what we're trying to do. It ain't easy. And after all you've accomplished, I could kiss you again. But I won't, because I know you just want to break it down, and I'd just rather read. Relax. We're cool. Good. Fine. Get your mama to put away her shotgun? Keep it up and I might use it on you myself. What was that crack about, Craig? I heard him make a date with you. A date? When? I... I don't know. No, well, on the phone, earlier. <laughs> I wasn't on the phone with Craig. He just got you. Again. I thought maybe you agreed to go out with him... Try and get back at me. Is that an apology? He tried to kill me. How? How? He... He was on my balcony, and then I went out there after, and the railing gave way. I told you to get that railing reinforced. So what now? This is my fault. You know what? I don't care whose fault it is. I, I don't want to do this anymore, Paul, okay? If you want to play bad guys with Craig, go ahead, just leave it's me out of it. not playing at anything. This isn't a game. Now that Lucy and Johnny are gone, Craig is more lethal than ever, and I'm not gonna... I can't let him hurt you, Meg. And I don't want you protecting me. You and I... <laughs> well, there is no you and I, remember? We're over. I just ran into the prince. You remember the prince, don't you? Rich guy, fast car, you were driving around with him yes, in a costume ball? Yes, of course I remember him. How's he doing? He's angry, Carly. It seems that somebody stole his family jewels. <sighs> not, not that again. He's filing an official complaint, which means that if I don't come across that necklace within a week, we've got an international incident on our hands. I'm sorry if he's pressuring you, Jeff. It's not me I'm worried about here. I don't have the necklace. And you've already tested the one that, that Katie stole from my house. She's the criminal here. But you know, she can keep it now that we all know it's a fake. Do you hear yourself, Carly? Well, Jack, I'm just trying to reassure you that I'm fine. Or that, that I will be when things get back to normal. Oh, Carly, you said goodbye to normal when you opened the door to Simon Fraser. We've combined serious drain cleaning power with technology of the future in two liquids to clear slow drains like no single drain cleaner can. It's Liquid Plumber Foaming Pipe Snake. A thick, dense foam that not only clears your slow drain, but cleans your pipe walls too. Liquid Plumber Foaming Pipe Snake. Use the power of tomorrow to clean that drain today. I'm fighting a cold. 
that I've got my first fight today. I need relief fast. I want Advil cold and sinus. With the power of Advil, plus a hard-hitting decongestant. That's the power of Advil cold and sinus. Now available at your pharmacy counter. Chapstick Moisturizer. It's the healthy look and feel lips long for. I barely have time for myself anymore, but Airwick Aromatherapy scented oils in essential oil fragrances like calming, soothing, and relaxation help me unwind and feel at ease. Airwick, it's good to be home. You want to party till dawn with friends that you can meet. Some great old navy sweaters for the whole family, starting at fifteen dollars. The extreme power of Energizer E squared lithium, the world's longest-lasting AA battery and high-tech devices. Energizer, keep going. Okay, girls. This one's for us. It's L'Oreal's new Age Perfect Makeup. It helps transform your complexion from dull to radiant. New Age Perfect gets back at those little spots and wrinkles. Now my skin, I'm talking radiant. New Age Perfect Skin Supporting and Hydrating Makeup by L'Oreal. Hey okay, guys, <laughs> here's the gift cards you purchased. Thanks. Happy holidays. You too, man. Thanks. <sighs> gift card. For every $25 you spend on a gift card, get a $5 bonus card for yourself. Everyone could use more Fridays. Tell me what your father might do. Jack Abbott is going to pay for his sin sooner or later, and I'm just making sure it's sooner. What are you afraid I'm going to find out? What's done is done. There's no going back. What is this about? If anybody finds this out, you could go to prison. Don't leave me here. I'm going crazy. No one knows. You're doing this for me. The Young and the Restless, CBS Weekdays. The NFL and United Way have been helping to strengthen America's communities for years. Maybe you can give us a hand. Volunteer at unitedway.org. Give your home the gift of new window treatments this holiday season and save 50%. Call Empire today during our Home for the Holidays sale. We'll bring samples right to your home where it's easy to match colors and styles to your decor. And we'll install your new window treatments next day. You'll save 50% and make no payments till 2008. You'll even get a free turkey. So call Empire today. Give your home the gift of new window treatments and save 50% now. 800-588-2300 Empire Today. Turn ordinary meals into something extraordinary. Santa Fe Packing Company Salsa Con Queso and Dips. All natural tomatoes, onions, peppers, and spices. I like it, I like it, I like it all that. Make everything taste better the way you like it. Santa Fe Packing Company. I like it, I like it, I like it all that. Yeah, I like it all that. Great cheer on our next show. Kathy Lee Gifford drops in for a game of Stump the Rage. I don't even want to tell you what I thought it was. And a couple of great holiday dips and spreads. Today at 2 on CBS 2 Chicago. Happy holidays. From all of us in CBS 2 Chicago. Share an evening honoring the world's greatest entertainers at the Kennedy Center Honors CBS Tuesday. I need to talk to you about something. Okay. Uh, Gordon Richards came to see you tonight as a favor to me. And because he knows I have a reputation of backing people with talent. But uh, I don't think he was expecting to like you as much as he did. I want to offer you a first look deal. My point is, um, this business is all about catching that wave. Mm -hmm. You caught it, babe. Now the trick is to ride it all the way to the beach. I mean, to be honest with you, I was winging it out there tonight. 
And if Gordon liked what he heard then, he's going to flip out when he hears the rest of our stuff. Yeah, if he's still willing to listen. I thought that's what a first look deal was all about. Yes and no. Um, I'm not saying he's not still going to like you and your music, but I think what really got his attention tonight was his own idea of how to sell you. Because Gordon Richards knows better than anything that uh, timing is key in this business. You know, for instance, he knows that if Elvis Presley came out in 68, nobody would have cared. If Sinatra came out today, <laughs> he'd never make it out of Hoboken. So, what are you saying? I'm saying... I think we need to make the most of this while we still have his attention. I'm fine with that. Are you fine with making a full-time commitment? You have it. You're cool with leaving school, devoting every minute of every day to this project. School is great. I'm just asking that maybe you put him on hold for a while. Take a semester off. You can always go back. I just really think we need to jump on this train while it's still moving. Okay. So let's say I take a semester off school, finish up the demo. And what happens if Gordon really likes what he hears? Well, then we're talking about going back in the studio, going on tour. Oh, my God. Is... <laughs> that a bad thing? No. It's just I... I never thought it all the way through. Well, you gotta ask yourself, how far are you willing to go to make this work? We're about to begin our descent into Oakdale International Airport. The captain has asked that you take your seats and fasten your seatbelts. Listen, Jack. I know you're in a tough spot with the prince. <laughs> really, it, it's his own fault for letting that girlfriend of his wear such an expensive piece of jewelry. What did he expect? So, so it's his fault that somebody robbed him? What? No. Come no, on, I'm just saying... It's over. Don't you understand? Well, whatever you suspect, you have zero proof. The diamond that Simon gave you. Is a fake. You said so yourself. The report said so. What the report also said was it was an exact replica of one of the diamonds missing. Well, that jewelry is very famous. I'm sure there have been lots of copies made. To make a copy, you have to have an original. Right. Well, so you're saying there's a jeweler That somewhere. had access to an original. Yeah. It's a theory. No, Carly, it's a fact. Well, what do you want me to say? Arrest the jeweler, then. Is that what you is that what you want me to do? You want me to arrest the jeweler, Carly? There's gonna be an investigation. I can't stop it. And we're gonna be looking at Simon. Now, you may be innocent, but as long as you're associating yourself with him, you're gonna be implicated, Carly. And with your record, you're going to jail. All right, you're angry. Not a good time, I guess, to talk about our relationship. We have no relationship. Well, will you think about Craig? No, that's that's your job, and you love it. So running Rosanna off the road, and taking Johnny away from Jennifer, and goading Dusty into shooting him, that, that, that was me. I did that. You know, now that you mention it, you were front and center at every one of those disasters. And not that I'm letting Craig off the hook, but I wasn't about to marry him. I'll do whatever you want me to do. You, you want me to cross the street every time I see him? Fine, I'll do that. You, I, I'm gonna, I'll go back now to the apartment and, and I'll find a, a phone book. And if his, if his name's in the phone book, I'll, I'll, I'll tear it out. That'll last today. No, it'll last forever. It has to last forever. Meg, I love you forever. Well, then you have a problem. Because I gave you a choice, Paul. Go after Craig or marry me. It was a moment of weakness. No, it's who you are. 
is who you are, Paul. And you know what? I bent over backwards and, and it was probably too far. And I, and I can't, I can't anymore. I cannot marry a man who thinks it's okay to use violence to solve his problems. Stop. You know that's not who I am. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out. Bad that gun wasn't loaded. He's gone. Hmm? new place the waiter says try this you'll like it what is it try it you'll like it so what did i do i ate it all took alka-seltzer alka-seltzer dissolves stomach discomfort and pain what watch this windex it's so powerful it starts to work even before you wipe because everyone loves a streak-free shine windex for a streak-free shine when I signed up for Vonage, I was able to keep my phone number. And then when I moved, I was able to take it with me. Call quality is the utmost. It projects my business. And with Vonage, it's perfect. Vonage and reliability, that just kind of goes hand in hand. It's just $24.99 a month for unlimited local and long distance calling. Vonage is a better way to phone for less. Get one month free. Call 1-888-900-4VOA. There were a lot of places she wanted to be for the holidays. A lot of people she wanted to spend time with. She just wanted to let everyone know she was there with them. Flowers are a passion. I'm Jim McCann. 1-800-Flowers.com has so many ways to show you care. Like our holiday magic ornament cookie jar. Or our designer collection expertly crafted by the world's top floral designers. Call, click, or come in today. 1-800-Flowers.com, your florist of choice. French vanilla cool whip. French vanilla's here for that special time of year. Do the cool whip. Happy holidays, just a dollop away. Do the cool whip. Add the French vanilla touch. That always means so much. Go, go, apple pie and cake. Ooh, it's time to celebrate. Ba la 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 la, French vanilla. I like it, I like it, I like it all that. Santa Fe Packing Company Salsa and Con Queso. All natural, delicious on everything. I like it all that. Yeah, I like it all that. Tonight. There's a little boy for sale. Now he's being auctioned off when that clock runs to zero. We need to find this boy. Criminal Minds. Then, a New York shopping spree. Get on the ground! Becomes a Hollywood style heist. Breakfast at Tiffany's it was a love story. No love here. CSI New York tonight. CBS Friday. Join host Rod Stewart and your favorite performers in a celebration for the whole family. A home for the holidays with Rod Stewart. New special CBS Friday. Well, Jack, you had me sufficiently scared. Now what? Now what? What do you want from me? You want a confession? You want me to trade what I know for a shorter sentence? Well, I don't know anything, and neither do you. So you can take your, your, your tactics and go back to the police station. That's what you think this is, Carly? I'm working you? That's sad. That's really, really very sad if that's what you think of me. How about what you think of me? How about we don't even talk about that? Can, can you give me at least, at least this much? In all the years you've known me, have I ever lied to you? No. no. Then why would I now? 
What would I gain? I've got nothing else to lose here, Carly. We're divorced. You moved on. That doesn't mean I still don't. Some other of my kids. I don't want you to go to jail. Do you really think that I want to go to jail? Okay, then listen to me, Carly, and do what I say, because you still have one more chance. But only if you stay away from Simon Fraser. So you think you could deal with me the way you deal with Dusty? You can't play me anymore, Craig. Not now, because I know that I know that you're trying to play me. You should watch your own back, because from now on, it's got a target on it. Boys, we're not a bank. And this isn't nursery school. You want to play, you pay. So show me your wallets, or I'm gonna call your lawyer father. No, look, that's not necessary, all right? We just need a little more time, okay? Hey, time for what? D hey, I'm kind of busy right now. Can I talk to you downstairs? What's going on? You, uh, know these clowns? Uh, yeah, I'm Adam Munson, Casey's older brother. Oh, good to meet you. Maybe you can talk some sense into your brother and his friend. Seems to be the problem. There's no problem. They just owe playpoker.com a little money. Seems they came up with a system, only we caught them, so now it's time to pay, right, boys? How much do they owe? 2800 Some kind of system. Well, they had a nice little run. But we need to keep the game clean. We owe it to the honest players, you understand. Yeah, I'm sure that's why you're here. 2800 That'll do it. Pleasure doing business with you, Mr. Munson. Yeah, I'll need a receipt. Of course. Your brother is really, really cool. I missed you so much. Yeah, me too. So, wow, why are you back early? I thought you were catching the late flight tonight. You know, we just, we finished up earlier than we thought, and I wanted to get home to see you. Oh, all right, good. Yeah. So how was it? How was L.A.? I mean, I, I tried calling you a couple times to, you know, find out how things were going. I guess your phone was off. You must have been working hard. Yeah, it was, it was crazy. I mean, they had me trying on all these clothes and, you know, this makeup, and at one point my hair was out to here, and then, you know, until I said no, and my mom showed up, which is a completely different story. But the good news is that I, I got this chance to sing at this open mic night, and there was this record executive there, and he really, he, he liked me. Of course he did. No, I, I mean, he really liked me. Like, he, he wants to give us a first look deal, which means that he gets first dibs at optioning the demo. So you, you like, already have a deal? No, I mean, it could, it could become that. But, you know, at first, he's got to like the demo, and then he'll probably want to take it back into the studio and change a bunch of stuff, which is fine. But it's a, it's a big step. That's great. Yeah. <laughs> I just, you know, I, I wanted to tell you, I wish you'd been there. It's really lonely getting, you know, this great news and not being able to share it. That's why I didn't call you. I, I wanted to see your face. Well, I felt the same way. I got into OU. You did? Yeah. Really? <laughs> That's awesome. I'm so <laughs> proud of you. <laughs> I was I was thinking about it, um, and we should we should probably keep the room here, you know, because it's a good place to study and to crash. And obviously we'll be spending most of our time at home, but it'll be the best of both worlds. It's gonna be great. We're, we're gonna be finally on the same schedule. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It it's gonna be like really great. That's it? What, what's wrong? Um, nothing. It's just that, well, I was thinking of leaving school. Heather Simone from Roswell, Georgia is last week's winner, and as the world turns, see it, text it, win it sweepstakes. Get your cell phone out and ready because this is your big chance to win $5,000. All you have to do is answer this question. I'm going to need your help. What does Dusty want Lucy to do? One, pick up baby Johnny from the babysitter. Two, ask Margot to get him a better jail cell. Three, help him escape. Text the number of the correct answer to 85888. 99 cents per text message entry. For free entry and official rules, go to CBS.com. The winner will be revealed on Wednesday, December 27th. You must be at least 18. Entries accepted until Friday, December 22nd at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. Color your hair when you're juggling a million other things? 
That's why I use L'Oreal's Excellence Cream. Talk about low maintenance. A non-drip excellence formula wraps around stubborn grays with a triple protection system built in. With shiny, totally low maintenance color. Excellence Cream by L'Oreal Paris. Each year in the U.S., thousands of women learn they have cervical cancer. I could be one less. One less statistic. One less. Because now there's Gardasil, the only vaccine that may help protect you from the four types of human papillomavirus that may cause 70% of cervical cancer. I want to be one less woman who will battle cervical cancer. One less. Like all vaccines, Gardasil may not fully protect everyone. The side effects include pain, swelling, itching and redness at the injection site, fever, nausea, or dizziness. Gardasil is not for women who are pregnant. Gardasil does not prevent all types of cervical cancer, so it is important to continue with routine cervical cancer screening. Gardasil will not treat cervical cancer. Ask your doctor about getting vaccinated with the only cervical cancer vaccine, Gardasil. 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 With Gardasil, you could be one less. I can't afford to get their colds. Now Chloroseptic introduces Chloroseptic Defense Health Strips, the new fast-dissolving strip that helps boost your immune system when you need it. Get real defense real easy with new Chloroseptic Defense. I barely have time for myself anymore, but Airwick Aromatherapy scented oils in essential oil fragrances like calming, soothing, and relaxation help me unwind and feel at ease. Airwick, it's good to be home. Dog meets Doug. Sparky, this is Arthur. Whatever you do, don't sniff his butt. The King of Queens. Then meet one of the best young comedy ensembles on TV today. Don't look at me. I'm wearing elastic waist fleece pants. And isn't it more comfy? Yes. A special How I Met Your Mother after a new King of Queens. CBS Tonight. You want to leave school? No, I mean, it's not that I want to. I love school. You, you know that. Yeah, and you've worked really hard to get here. And I, I'd come back. It's just for a semester so I can finish up the demo. And I guess I'd, I just didn't get it, you know, until I went out there. You didn't get what? Well, back here, I'm pretty good. I mean, I'm even, like, very good compared to the musicians in Oakdale. But when I was in L.A., I heard a couple of people sing, and they were nobody. And they were incredible. And they had their whole look together, and they had management, and they had serious interests coming from the industry. Well, I thought this guy was going to give you a shot. Like... Well, he is, but Adam thinks that, you know, if they're going to give us an opportunity... Adam, Adam thinks? What, so what does Adam have to do with this? Well, he brought it up, but, I mean, he's right. I need to be committed to this 100%. I can't split my time and my focus. I mean, I need to get this demo done so I can get it over to the record exec before he forgets about me. You only get one shot with these guys. And if he thinks that the market is ready for me now, then I gotta be ready for him. And you can't do that and go to school, too? I honestly don't see how. Okay. Well, if that's what you need, then I'm with you. You sure? I mean, because I can't do this without you. And and I won't I won't do this if you if you don't want me to or I don't have your support. No, you got it. So just relax. Hang out here. I'm gonna go get us a couple sodas. Okay? Yeah. That was amazing, Adam. Yo, he had us, that guy had us against the wall, man, the wall. And then he comes in walking like James Bond. Don't you have some place you need to be, Elwood? Me, no. Yes, I have this thing at this place. Uh, listen, Adam, thanks a lot. I'm going to pay you back yeah. right after Christmas. You will. Yeah, uh, maybe. <laughs> thanks a lot, man. You've been so great about lending me money. and. Uh, I know that I said I'd quit, but, man, we have this system, and it, it's working. Yeah. Well, anyways, I'm sorry, and I'm going to pay you back. No, this is my fault. What, what do you mean? A few weeks ago, there was a couple guys down the hall. Now you got a major enforcer from a gambling site here well, in your that, dorm room. That wasn't so bad, though. All the guy was going to make me do was tell mom and dad, which is why I really appreciate you helping me out. I didn't help you out. You're going to tell him? No. No, you're going to tell him. 
Well, looky here. It's the little superstar's hubby. Does your parole officer know you went to L.A.? I'm back, aren't I? Besides, I didn't have anywhere to go since he kicked me out. So L.A. seemed like a good idea. Yeah, well, my baby needed me. At least I thought she did until I saw. Well, <laughs> never mind. Gwen here? Until you saw what? I saw how beautifully she sang. I tell you, that girl's got great talent. Just as good as her mama. But you see, well, I didn't have any management. Certainly not like she does. Tell you, that brother of yours, ooh, he knows how to handle a woman. What's that supposed to mean? Nothing. Just, uh, you know, when you're that good looking and ambitious and, oh, the way he could wheel and deal. And he treated Gwen like a queen and she just lapped it up. I mean, who wouldn't? You know, you really can't blame if she. She here? She doesn't want to see you, Iris. No, no. I guess she really doesn't want to. She doesn't need to, now that she has Adam. So what are you saying? Are you saying that if I stay away from Simon, you'll guarantee that I won't go to jail? I can't guarantee you anything. But you'd like me to stay away from him. Simon is a known jewel thief, Carly. That's not your M.O. The police won't have any reason to link you to this crime, except for your relationship. You know, I don't know how to say this without making you mad <sighs> or... Maybe hurting your feelings. Would you just say it? All this advice. Are you sure, Jack, that you're not just jealous? Well, that's the thing about divorce. I've, I've forgotten just how stubborn you are. You're asking me to trust you. I'm telling you to stay away from him for your own good. Asking you to trust me, Carly. You've always trusted me. That's never been our problem. Look, you do what you want. Jack, what, when... Why? Why? You're not listening no, to me. No, I am. I am. I heard you. And I'll think about it. And I appreciate you caring what happens to me. I still care about you. I always will. Right. Well, that's very comforting. Thank you. Jack. No, Carly. It's done. I'm over you do what you want. Right, Jack. You know, you're right. I don't want to give anybody any reason to look at me. So I'll, I will tell Simon that we should cool it for a while. You know, at least while the prince is in town. Carly, if you want to keep what you have left, your career, your kids, your freedom, you have to say goodbye to Simon Fraser for good. Mama, I know I owe you an explanation. No, 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 sweetheart. You don't owe me anything. Anything. Mm -hmm. You want to help me with the ornaments? Mm -hmm. That used to help, didn't it? You still love him? Are you ever going to be happy without him? I can't marry him, Mama. That doesn't make it hurt any less. I'll go get the tinsel.
three of us are alone. True. Sure. It doesn't have to stay that way. Merry Christmas, Snyder family. Hi, Jay Bush and Cousin Drew here for Bush's Homestyle Chili. I slow cook it according to a secret family recipe with premium ground beef and a special blend of spices for a homemade taste. Say, Drew, what do you say you let me see where you keep the secret family recipe? All right, Jay. But don't tell your dog, Duke. He can't keep a secret. Duke, how'd you get in here? Oh, I uh, had some doggy doors put in. Enjoy Bush's Homestyle Chili. Looks like homemade, tastes like homemade. Take, take, take. That's what some cleansers do. Luckily, there's new Olay Hydrate and Cleanse. It's Olay Moisture refortifies your skin. So get a cleanser that actually gives more than it takes. When you've got a burning, scratchy, sore throat, a few blasts can change everything. Introducing VIX 44 Sore Throat. Fast sore throat pain relief with cooling VIX vapors. Do VIX 44 Sore Throat. Tell your throat to just chill. Mom's making rich chocolate Ovaltine hot. Yeah! Ovaltine's made with milk, so it tastes creamy. And it's more nutritious than Swiss Miss or Nestle Hot Cocoa. We're back. Who wants Ovaltine hot? Me! Me too. More Ovaltine hot, please. Oh, oh, no, I'm not. Tis the season for my amazingly powerful Oric XL. Now, Santa, you get it at the Oric store. Let's go. Look, Santa, it picks up pine needles and reindeer hair. How about this stocking stuffer, my car vac? Hey, look at that. Get the XL Classic and two free gifts for $2.99. Oh, oh, oh. Visit warwickstore.com for the store nearest you. Happy holiday. Give, give. All I do is give to you, Sophia. I deserve it, Marcello. Giving gifts? Get lots more holiday gifts for your money when you get them at Burlington Coat Factory. The place for great gifts for the whole family. Get up to 60% off department store prices on famous designer labels. Plus, a new cash back policy. The more you give Marcello, the more you save. Burlington Coat Factory, where you celebrate by saving money. Thursday. This is a perfect half-inch scale model of the room. The killer obviously wanted it to be found. It's real blood. CSI then. Oh, God. In L.A., the rich think they can get away with murder. You try anything clever, I'm going to bury you. Just guys on our side. But these prosecutors are going to give them a run for their money. If we believe a crime's been committed, it's our duty to prosecute. Now, it's payback time. Shark after CSI, CBS Thursday. It was the home run of home runs. And the pay, 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 pay. He was the best of the best until somebody killed him. Who? No one ever know. Clyde Taylor, 20, beaten to death, struck down with his very own bat. His gear bag and mitt were found next to him. The bat was missing. Suspects? A nun. White pitcher who loses to a black team in 1945 may have just pitched himself out of baseball. Is that why he had to die? Cold case in a special time, CBS Sunday. <laughs> Tune in to CBS 2, weekdays at 2, for The Rachel Ray Show. Brought to you locally by your Chicagoland and Northwest Indiana Buick dealers.